I felt real thankful and grateful that I have a peace that surpasses all understanding and that I've been blessed most of my life to have that kind of a peace and that I've just had the ability to release any kind of negative toxic uh, energies that entered my life you know whether it was through dating or friendships or whatever you know everybody doesn't isn't able to do that you know and they stay attached to things that don't serve them and even though I've had a lot of turmoil in my life I never allowed that to define me and I feel very blessed that I, I'm able to transcend all of that negativity and seek a higher a higher meaning and a higher thought that allows me to stay positive and focused on the things that really matter you know love peace joy happiness I, I want that for everyone you know I want others to feel the kind of peace that I have do I feel uncomfortable sometimes I absolutely do but I'm just thankful that when I have those moments, I face those emotions, and I have fears, I do, and I face those fears, as scary as it can be, but I'm so thankful that even though I'm al I've am i been alone for a, a, most of my adult life, um, I, I didn't allow that to, to ruin my perception and rob me of my belief that love exists. Happiness is a state of mind, you know? You can be in the middle and in the center of hell, but still have a peace, you know? That's what we decide to embrace. Have I had flight and fight yes I have my life has been a series of battles and wars you know I've been I've been through serious abuse you know where my life could have been taken so I don't want it to seem as though I haven't had any trouble in my life I have but I didn't allow myself to stay there in it I left so I could find my peace you can't pay for peace. You can't pay for joy. Money doesn't buy you happiness. We need it and I will have it, but it's how we how we utilize it and and what kind of power we give to it. I love God. I'm not a religious zealot, but I love to study theology because of the principles um, that I can can get something from from those texts. There's other texts out there, other you know. Uh, but that's the reason why I like to read the, the, the you know religious texts. It's so that I can be a principal person. Do I make mistakes? I absolutely make mistakes. Do I get weak with my flesh? Sometimes I do, you know. I just haven't met the right person that God has for me, but I have not given up. And I just think, I think the heavenly host for giving me opportunities to do it over every day. And I only hope that I can inspire a generation, you know, to seek peace, love, happiness. It, it, it can, it can happen, but if it has to be a collective thing, we got to change this world and we can.